Welcome to the 2015 Doncaster Secondary College Formal Video. I'm here with the beautiful Jaden Jax. And the lovely Connor Rogers. Come join us for a few interviews with your fellow students. Still looking forward to the formal, brother? No. Why not? Because it means I have to see people. You're not a fan of people, Bryce? I am, just not this people. Anyone? Will we be able to see Octavia belt out a tune at the formal? No, I'm, I'm looking for your tune to be belted out. Oh, mate, if we have karaoke, we'll be doing a bit of Uptown Girl. Oh, it's going to be a grouse night. should be a good show on as well. You're looking forward to it, Mariah? Yes, yep, a lot. She's been living in her uptown world. The formal, mate. No, no, no. We're back here with Manny, he's just finished eating, and can you tell us about formal Manny? I've never been to one. Last time I went to it I got kicked out 11 minutes in. So you've never been to one but you got kicked out? Yes. We've got the formal coming out, Porco, you looking forward to it mate? No, I'm not going. You're not going? Formal video. What about the formal video? Just I'm, not, I'm not going to formal. Oh, okay. We've got the formal coming up later in the no, year, I'm not too far away. We're here with Brianna oh, Cardamo. Oh, stop it, I don't attend formals. You're not coming to the formal, Brianna? No, I don't attend formal. You're seriously not coming? No, I don't go to formal. Are you above the formal, are you, Brianna? Yeah, I'm too good for that. There will be a girl disappointed, I reckon, that uh, if you're not going. Uh, I'll go, but I have to wear my flanny. Will you be with the Melbourne Victory Boys instead, will we, Brianna? Oh, you're flanny, not rocking a suit? Yeah, no, nah, no, nah, definitely not. Sarah, what do we think of Jack not rocking a uh, suit to the formal? He's wearing a suit to the formal. What do you reckon about that, Jack? Today's obviously the what you want to be when you're older today. Uh, you want to be an avatar, do you? I do, I do. Brother. Hey, stop right there! You stop right there! All right, what's going on? What you want to be when you're older today, Jimmy? What do you want to be, mate? I want to be a bludge traffic stopper guy. You know, that does nothing, just holds a sign up all day, gets paid hundred grand a year. That's me. Hey, we're here with Bud Risk. What will you be having before the formal? Any, uh, any, any bud? Maybe. Are you looking forward to the formal this year? I am. Who are you going to be dressed by, Steph? I'm going to be dressed by Zimmerman. Hey, can we have some decorum on the set? Thank you. <laughs> so, who are we going to be dressed by, Steph? Um, Zimmerman. Versace. Uh, Zimmerman. Abyss by Abby. Miss Betson. I don't know. I don't know the brand. I have no idea. It's pink, though. It's pink. Yeah. So. My special, it's 50 bucks, whole outfit, it's pretty good. Um, my mum, actually. We're here with the great uh, Julian Galotta, aka... No, 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 no. Are you serious? Today's the what you want to be when you're older day, so here we are with Mr. Teeny. And will you be rocking your uh, golfing uniform to the formal, will you, Mr. Teeny? Oh, there's no doubt. There's no doubt. When you find an animation... Who you dressed by? Huh? Who, what brand are you wearing? Cray? Yeah. Who will you be dressed by, mate? I'll be dressed by, uh... Ah. Oh! <laughs> Pardon? You, you asking me? What brand are you wearing? Who are we dressed by, Pam? Um, Swish. That's a winner. Swish. Suit. So, yeah. I wear a suit. Good, yeah. Okay. Oh, that's a good question. Probably Sarah as well. I don't know what brand it is. Savers, Target, Kmart, Woolworth. I meant, I meant brand, I meant brand, mate. What brand oh, are we wearing? Fucking, I don't know. No. Wait, I'm in this time. I don't even have a dress. Just going naked, are we? No. You're probably not going to win dress best. Nisha, who will you be dressed by? As in, uh, what are we talking, Louis Vuitton? Bit of a Versace? Um, look. I don't know what I'm saying. You don't know what you're saying. We're on par here, all right? Okay. All right. Um, what are you wearing? I'm wearing a suit. By what? What brand? No idea. Who are you taking to the formal, Jamie? Me, myself, and I. <laughs> myself. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. That's my answer. She goes alright, doesn't she? Yeah, really great. <laughs> Not going to be any lucky boys on the night, Jamie? <laughs> no. <laughs> Have you seen this bunch? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the lucky guy? No one. Oh, there's too many to choose from, so... Oh, really? Got too many know. options. Well, Vanessa over here wishes, but... Jacqueline, Ricotta, Rigged, Tony, how are we? Good. Best couple, do you reckon you're a chance? <laughs> um, no, I think there's a few other good couples out there. Like who? Who do you reckon is a chance of taking your spot? Um, Pablo and Harry, I think. M Miss Price for just in a shot. Of <laughs> uh, 
I heard that Matthew marries Age is still looking for a formal partner. Oh, does he want to come with me? Am I the lucky woman? I think uh, if Matt went with you, he'd be the uh, champion, if you know what I'm oh. saying. <laughs> <laughs> I've had a few uh, few people ask me, but um, I've had to say no to all of them. Who's the lucky girl that you'll be taking to the formal, Bryce? Myself. Do you plan on getting a bit of action with your date then later on in the Oh, night? yeah, you know it. Oh, Friday man. night. The bit of right hand action. And left hand. Depart, depart, depart. Jonathan Shermer, how are you, mate? I'm very good, thank you. Shermer! Hey. Who's the uh, lucky guy? There is no one. That's unfortunate. <laughs> I'm still looking for a uh, formal partner. Oh, really? Yeah. Do you want to ask me something? Connor, would you like to go to formal with me? Not really. Okay. Uh, Adrian, are we going together? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, now we're getting to the VIPs. Yeah, now, we're getting the <laughs> now we're getting to the VIPs. We've got the great Rob Finch. My tip for the uh, best couple at the formal, we've got Rob and Jackie. Uh, who, who are you going to be dressed by, Rob? Uh, probably Target, so Kmart. Love a good Kmart suit. Yeah. Do you reckon Jackie will be looking mighty fine, Rob? Yeah, probably. Are we looking forward to getting a bit of action there at the formal? Uh, maybe a little bit after. A little bit after, just get a few bevs into it. What do you? Yeah. <laughs> it might be a bit risky if you take her. If you know what I'm saying. This interview <laughs> just got finished. <laughs> Who are you taking to the formal, Manny? Um, it's between um and and we're here with Christian, as you can see. How are we, Christian? Superb. Who are you taking? I thought I was taking you. I'm sorry, man, I don't swing that way, but maybe, you know, things change. Look, I'm going to say me, but, yeah. Oh, the arrogance. The arrogance from the man. I don't know, some internationals. <laughs> Ooh, okay, Ooh, that's a bit risque. All right. Who do you think the best dressed uh, male will be? Um, um, probably Connor. Oh, how about that? Thanks, Alex, appreciate You're it. Welcome. And uh, who's your tip for best dress? Thank you, Connor. Thank you, appreciate it. Can I start with nice shorts? You can. Nice shorts. Thank you. Um, any advice to the girls? Uh, less is not best. Mm. That's definitely my advice. Yes? Keep a bit of suspense. Yes. Mm. Exactly. You've got to leave something to the imagination. Do you have a date for the evening? No, I don't have a date for the evening. Oh. So I'm open to offers at this stage. I actually don't have a date. That could be convenient. Yeah? Mm. Okay. Um, <laughs> I don't even know what to say now. Okay. So, Matt Marazita, how do you think tonight's formal has gone? Oh, it was actually really good, and uh, oh, and when we watched my uh, film, it was, uh, made me feel really, really happy. All I have to say is, I got that first real six string, boy, I can five and dive. Now, an interesting moment in journalism, when the interviewer becomes the interviewed. Here we have the winner of Don't Give Up Your Day Job Award because comedy is a tough gig and you can't be hit with every crowd. I beg to differ. Here we are with Connor Rogers. How are we? I am fantastic, Jaden. Thanks for having me. Now, what do you think of this award? Look, I don't, I, it's a bit of a piss take. I think my comedy is actually fantastic, so the fact that they are... Uh, that they decide to take the piss out of it. I'm uh, mildly offended, but uh, also greatly appreciated, Jaden. What are your thoughts on the awards tonight? Do you think uh, do you think Mr. Hemsley deserved the best bloke? For sure, he's the best ever. Why do you think he's the best, Vanessa? Because he's a dick. Because he's a dick? Yeah. So you like dicks? You think dicks are the best? No, shut up! Well, how many beverages are we planning on having tonight, Lynchy? 20 plus. We're here with everyone's favourite, Mr. Reynolds. How are you, sir? I'm terrific, thanks, Connor. You did a great job earlier. Well done. Thank yeah, you. Very talented. Really appreciate it, sir. What? To your footy team too. Bit, bit of a cheap shot there, but sorry, uh, sorry. that's all right. That's all right. I'll cop it. Here with everyone's favourite teacher, Mr. Hemsley. How are you, sir? Good, mate. How are you? Absolutely fantastic. You're the uh, winner of the 2015 Best Bloke Award. Uh, is this the crowning achievement of your life? I think it must be, mate. Well, you know, this year, you know, haven't had many highlights. Or, you know, it was, there was an engagement, but you know what? Well, I think this does pip it. Like, just awesome to be nominated for this, so well done. I think you chose the right person. Uh, what are your thoughts on coming uh, third in the Best Bloke Award? Do you reckon uh, Mr. Hemsley deserves it? 
No, 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 no. Cosmo Kramer, the big Greek, the little fat yeah. Greek boy. No, I, I, he's got a big ego now. He certainly didn't need to win that. I'm very glad you used the title Adonis when you presented my award. And um, Mr Reynolds, just remember that. They used that word, not me. So, Adonis. Enjoying your night? I'm having a blast. What about you? Absolutely. You're very well, considering your condition. I am. Uh, I do have a slight contusion on my ankle. Um, you must be absolutely elated considering you've won Best Dressed Male. This is the most probably prestigious award of the night and the award that means the most to me, it's, it's made my night. I think uh, you didn't really have much competition there. Mr. Hensley Don't looks... take it away from me. Don't take it away from me. <laughs> no. I earned this. You did earn it. Mr. Hemsley looks like he's coming the same clothes he wears to school though, you reckon? Pretty sure he actually did wear that shirt today. I'm yeah, I, I thought so as well. For me, an absolute disgrace that this man did not win best dress tonight. Have a look at a man, absolutely stunning. Uh, who did win best dress? I can't remember. Uh, Chiwei, wasn't it, or someone like that? Uh, no, some international. Some international, but you definitely deserve your Christmas. I think I did. I think I did. The school has voted, and they believe that you're going to be the future Prime Minister of Australia. Do you reckon you're a chance? Uh, if the school thinks I have a chance, I must. This school is a uh, fortune-telling school, you know. If you could change one thing about the Australia right now, if you're Prime Minister, what would that change be? Uh, that change would probably be to welfare. I'd give more welfare to more people. Well done, Adam. Uh, just remember me when you become Prime Minister, mate. We are here with arguably the uh, most beautiful girl here tonight and arguably the most inebriated here tonight. How are you, Julian? Yeah, I'm great, babe. Thank you. How are we, uh, Emerson? Yeah, I'm good. You're not going to thank you for that compliment I gave you before? Yes, thank you. That's what I thought. Who are you dressed by, Rachel? My sir. Which brand are you dressed by, Rachel? Bariano. Absolutely lovely. And uh, we saw Caddison came in second. Do you reckon, do you reckon she deserves to be I, there? Or? I love her dress. So gorgeous on her, yeah. We're with the absolutely stunning Caddison Risk. How are you, Caddison? I'm good. How are you? Sensational. Enjoying your night? Yeah, it's been pretty good. Pretty fun, I think. How do you feel winning second best dress tonight? I think, uh, I think you're stiff not to win. I like... I was pretty shocked. I didn't really want to walk up there. I was pretty embarrassed. But... Really, nigga? Oh, I have no credit. Before, before we were so rudely interrupted, yes. uh, are you happy with second or do you think you should have come first? No, I'm like happy to even be noticed, let alone come first. I'm fine. All right, who's next? Okay. Good to you to you me. Okay. We're here with Sahil. How are you, Sahil? Good. You enjoying your night? Yeah. Uh, you didn't poll tonight in the top three uh, best dress. Do you think you should have? No, that's fine. I'm ha it's okay. You're happy with that? Yeah, yeah. Did you, did you happen to win an award tonight, Sahil? Nope. Do you think you deserved an award? Uh, do I say yes to this? Do I say yes to this? <laughs> We're back, are we? Yes. Oh, okay, okay, good. Well, that was fucking dreadful. I got a problem with this place. Why? There's not enough mirrors for you. Ah, uh, that's right. Well, that's a giant mirror over there. I've been looking at myself all day. I think you were absolutely robbed of the How I Made Your Mother Award by Zai Wong. If you're not the best bloke in this year level, I don't know who is. Oh, well, you know, Zai is pretty good at uh, what he does. So he's uh, pretty well deserving, but uh, I was robbed. We're here with two of my absolute best mates, Francis Fazio, otherwise known as Swaki, and Harry Carnezis. How are we, lads? Not too bad about yourself. Doing absolutely uh, fantastic. How are you, Frankus? What? How are you, Frankus? Good, good. Yep. That is sensational. Uh, who do we think? Uh, who do we think was best dressed tonight, lads? Um, Miss Benson, of course. What about you, Harry? Ooh, I think uh, Miss Chitrelli. Fuck! How good did she oh, look? Unbelievable. I reckon she wants me. Oh, I think she wants me. Do you reckon you'll have a chance, Frank? With Chicharelli? Yeah, Forsum. Me and Harry already in. Forsum, Forsum. We're in, we're in already. Uh, Frank, right. are you in? Uh, outside chance. You're trying to cut my lunch. <laughs> what do you reckon your favourite award was today for the teachers? It's hard to say. Miss Chicharelli was looking pretty good. So I'd probably have to say her. Do you reckon we're, uh, do you reckon we're half a chance here, Brandon, with uh, Chicharelli? Ooh, it's tough to say, see, Rog. I mean, if we were graduated year 12, which we are probably right now, I reckon we might be within a chance, might be within a chance. You're a good looking, uh, you're a good looking fellow, Brando. I reckon you're half a sniff there. Yeah, you know what, not as good as you, Siraj, but... I'm pretty good. We could get in there, we could get in there. What about your thoughts on best dressed female? Do you reckon Chish deserve that? 
I reckon you reckon Chich deserve that, but no, she does. She looks absolutely ravishing. She does look ravishing. She'd look even more ravishing if her last name was Rogers. What do you think of our best dressed female? Do you reckon Chicharelli deserved that one? Yeah, she's a, del <laughs> she's a delightful person. She is extremely delightful, I, I think. Who do you think best dressed female was? You know what? I can't go past Miss Chich. Don't say that too quickly. I get a bit excited there when you mention Miss Chicharelli. Where is she? Oh, she's left. She's left. She's left, has she? She left. She gave me a goodbye kiss on the way out there, so it's okay. Here with Miss Chicharelli. How are you, Miss? I'm very well, thank you. Enjoying your night? It's actually fantastic. It's been a really good night. Everyone's been on the dance floor, very friendly. Um, a lot of people are, you know, socialising. Mildly inebriated? Uh, I hope not. You know, there's a lot of emotions going around. The atmosphere is pretty good. We definitely, definitely are. But you must feel absolutely wrapped to win Best Dress this year. Uh, do you feel honoured? Do you feel like this might be the grand achievement of your life to this date? Or is it just something that you'll stick on the fridge and won't look at too much? You know, I don't think I can really go anywhere from here. Like, my life's been pretty cruisy, but this is probably the peak. The pinnacle. Yeah, this is the pinnacle. And, um, I mean, I'm done now. What, what else can I achieve? You can achieve a wedding one day. Speaking of which, do you have, do you have a male companion at this time? Next question. Would you like one? Next question. What are your thoughts on Filipinos? Who do you think best dressed female was tonight? Definitely Miss Bedson. Miss Bedson did look absolutely stunning. Uh, if she was single, do you reckon you'd consider, consider an option there? I'm already considering an option. Ready, mate? What's happening after this? Are you going home or are we going out with the teachers or what's, what's happening there? My husband's picking me up and I'm going home to bed. What are we doing after this, ladies? Um, we're going to get fucked up. I love that. Do you think you are both deserving winners of the award tonight? No. Really? I think you look stunning, Rachel. Oh, no. oh, thanks. When the person ran out, they go, and the winner of this award, Rachel Kim. I've gone, you're fucking joking. <laughs> Surely it's Rachel Cosoletto. They've got the wrong Rachel here. You were very stiff not to win the uh, Wish You Were My Mum award. Uh, Dude, I'm cut. I'm very upset. I thought you would be. I, d I thought when they read out Xanis, I've gone, you're fucking joking. Well, it's pretty hard to compete with Xanis. I mean, she is the boss. She is the boss. Um, what are we doing after this? Are we going down somewhere with a few teachers and having a few beverages or? I don't think it's appropriate to say. So I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> what are our plans for after this? Are we going back to one of each other's house or? Um, don't know yet. What's happening, Angus? I'm going to go to bed. Nusha's bed or your own? My bed. You insipid thing. No, but uh, who do you think was best dressed tonight? Mate, off him. I need to go. I need this myself. Oh my God. Oh, seriously. 3:28 a.m. Here with the great Byron Manning. How are you, Baz? I'm great. I'm, I'm feeling. I'm feeling fine. We've had the former. What do you think of it? It was pretty good. We I reckon packed a punch at the start. We you know dragged down at the end, but we we did. We finished well. We did finish well, and we're at the after party now. Uh, how are you enjoying things here, Byron? Getting slowly abbreviated. I mean, ne 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 that's the one. Yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, good. How are you, Helena? Yeah, I'm good. How are you? Yeah, man. We've just had the formal. What do you think of it? It was great. It was great, wasn't it? And now we're at the after party. Are yeah. we planning on getting having a few beverages? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Are we feeling the effect? Are you feeling the effects already, Helena? Yeah. <laughs> we want to thank you for your time for watching this, and hope everyone has a good night at formal. But there is one more person to thank, I believe. Isn't there, Jaden? Matthew Marazita, the creator, editor, and filmer of our uh, of our formal video. Thank you so much, Matt. Mate, no worries. It was a pleasure. F go. F <laughs> We're here with the creator of this film, Matthew Marazita. How are you, mate? Good. We want to thank you for all your time. You've put in hours of effort. I have. You're an absolute champion, Matt. Well done, mate. You're welcome. 